Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to show for the rectangular hyperbola xy equal to c square, the radius of curvature is x square plus y square whole power 3 by 2 by 2 c square. From the given equation, we are going to find dy by dx. So, we have xy equal to c square. We are going to differentiate this using the product rule. So, the product rule formula is u b method which is u dash b plus u b dash. So, u dash, the differentiation of x is 1 and b is written as it is that is y plus u is written as it is that is y x and the differentiation of y is dy by dx and on the other side c square is a constant so it is 0. Let us take this y to the other side. So, x dy by dx is equal to minus y. From this we get dy by dx equal to minus y by x. Now we have to do quotient rule for finding its second derivative d square y by dx square. So the method is when we have u by v it is u dash v minus u v dash by v square. So here u is y and v is x. Let us keep the minus sign separate. u dash that is the differentiation of y is dy by dx and v is as it is minus u is as it is and v dash is 1 whole divided by v square which is x square. Now in place of this dy by dx we can substitute minus y by x. So, this will be minus y by x into x minus y whole divided by x square. So, we can cancel this to the minus 2y and there is a minus sign outside. So, plus 2y by x square. Now, coming to the radius of curvature formula rho is 1 plus dy by dx whole square and whole power 3 by 2 then whole division its second derivative which is d square y by dx square. Now in place of dy by dx we have minus y by x and when we substitute here this is 1 plus we have to square. So, y square by x square. Then we have whole power 3 by 2. Then whole division we have 2y by x square. So, this is 2y by x square. And in the numerator we are going to take LCM and the LCM is x square. So, x square plus y square by x square and the power 3 by 2 we have to take separately for the numerator and separately for the denominator then whole division 2y by x square. Now we can cancel this. So we have x cube. So finally this is x square plus y square whole power 3 by 2 by x cube and this we can take its reciprocal and multiply x square by 2y because by division rule this will go to the numerator. So, x square by 2y. So, after cancelling this we left with only x. So, finally we have radius of curvature rho is x square plus y square whole power 3 by 2 whole divided by 2 this is x this is y x y but in the question they have given x y is c square so I am going to replace in the denominator so the radius of curvature rho will be x square plus y square whole power 3 by 2 whole divided by 2 and the value of 
x y from the question is c square. So two c square. So we got the given proof.